Hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Little King Story. Now, it's been a while and I was sick, but now I'm fine, so... Let us go teach King Shishkababu or King Shishkababu a lesson, and let's turn our volume down, because it's way too loud. There we go, 13 should be a good volume level, and... Let's see what we can build, right? Uh, well, we have these letters, which... Which are not really important. Uh, no guardians, or just, you know, normal quests. What we can do right now is go to the kingdom plan. Uh, we have any power ups? Uh, we do, but I don't know if I should. Sp uh, wait, I, I will, because it's kind of you know useful in the next battle. We have um, shopping arcade, blah blah blah. But we need people, so we're gonna just build an uptight residence and go outside, because we need to go over to Kingdom, I mean, Ripe Kingdom, and, uh, you know, kick King King Shishkababu's butt and stuff. And I'm kind of sleepy, so my commentary will be less than great, because I am retarded. So let's see, citizen list, uh, well, let's call everyone off for... Actually, no, let's call everyone or Okay, so... Stop mumbling around, and for this next battle, we need soldiers with, uh, whoops, with, uh, with high HP, uh, things, so we're gonna take these guys, we also need miners, a lot of them, um, uh, we're, g we're gonna need some hunters, that farmer's okay, we don't really need a carpenter, but whatever, uh, Let's see, oh, we got, oh, right, we, we got the expansion thing so we can get more people in our party, like, hunters. Okay, all of them are in. Uh, oh, crap, okay. We go Julian, uh, our brand new carefree adults. Uh, let's take these guys off, they don't really help much. Uh, let's take our best soldiers, which... Uh, I, I really need to upgrade them, because I don't want them, you know, because they're just no, normal soldiers, and I want them to be, like, super soldiers sometime. I mean, someday. Uh, so let's go! Right, after that short amount of mumbling, I am ready to go to the battlefield. Alright, and to make things less complicated, I'm gonna make a line with the evade formation, so they don't get lost and they follow my every move, like if I do a circle thing here, wee. They all follow it, no matter what. Look at that. Just going around in circles. Ha 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 ha. Ha 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 ha
Cake's important. You do not want it to hit your shoulders. Your shoulders, yes. Uh, let's see. We can just throw a bunch of people into that teacup and that strawberry. So they can destroy them. Uh, that is really slow. So. Uh, what's happening? I mean, okay, they beat you to it. We got some sweets. And what does a teacup give us? More sweets. Uh, whoops. Almost. Do that one. Uh, go back. Cake time. Attack. When you attack, I'll just break my little dessert barrier here. Teacup. Teacup. Tea party barrier, whatever. Whoops, I called them all back. Oh, uh, just, just break those things. Okay, we got more sweets. Uh, we got more sweets over here. And I'm uh, pretty sure we can break that. There you go. Got more sweets. And there's a signboard here. It says, Message Board of Love. Welcome, Corbo. People obtain happiness by gorging on love. Love is like a sweet whipped cream. More love means more satisfaction. I will await the delivery of your love. It will be sure... I will be sure to enjoy it well. Love and sweets, King Shish Kababu. Now, that means he wants to eat us. That was kind of subtle, but that is basically the message he wants to convey, so... Kinda creepy, you know? And when you see him, it's gonna be even creepier, you know? Because he is the creepiest king in the whole game. I can assure you that, because I've seen it... I mean, I've seen him with my own eyes. And it is disturbing. He is disturbing. How disturbing, you'll see in a few minutes. Let's get rid of that Oni 2. Whoops, I sent a soldier in. You can do it, come on. What the- Ah, uh, you stopped. Okay. Ugh! No, you're supposed to keep throwing arrows at him. Do not stop just because the cake stopped. Okay, he's dead. Great. Let's break that teacup. Teacups. Oh, uh, God. Well, break that one! Gosh. Great, we got... What was that? Tea biscuit. Okay. And that is broken, and here is a giant rock. And it is, you guessed it, a rock monster. And we can beat it in one hit with one miner, and he is basically done with. Now, let's see, I don't think we have any soldiers with no health left, so let's take our hunters very carefully, go back. And I do not want to waste, I mean, I, don't, I do not want to lose any uh, hit points for this battle, because it's, it's really, really important you have all of your hit points intact. And by all of your hit points, I mean all of the king's hit points, because they are really useful in the next battle end. I mean really useful, like, you do not want to go in there if you don't have full health. That's how important they are. But in case you don't have them full, you can always break this rock, and if you brought a carpenter, you can, I mean, <laughs> a farmer, you can throw him at the thing over there, and it's hot spring, but we don't need it right now, because we have full health on everyone, so... Let's uncover that, and go back here. Let's break those cakes. One by one, till you shout, enough, I'm done. One down. Two down, two down, okay. Uh, three down, four down, five down, okay. And there's this little gi a giant strawberry over here. Let's break that too. Retreat! I see Onis in the distance, we need to kill them first. While well, you do that, I'll break the strawberry, okay? No, you do not want to stop firing at them, why? An RPs, ooh. Let's see. Number 67, Scavenger. That is actually pretty good, not that bad. Uh, actually not that bad, it's really good. I like it. If only every piece of art was like that. And I wouldn't be mad at my stupid drawings not making it in the game. Even though I didn't submit anything, but still. I wanted to submit something. I mean, if I knew this game was great, I would have definitely done that. What if my UMA made it as a boss? I mean, that's awesome. I mean, what if... Uh, King number seven. 
is a drawing from High Leonardo, and he is a great boss. What the crap? We better kill him. Oh, there we go. Okay. Here's the other one. Oh, he had an art piece. Oh, he had arrows. Sorry, my bad. Oh, let's see. Don't do it. Come on, kill him. No, you. Ah, stupid AI. <laughs> All at once, okay. Another signboard. Today's special cake combo. Fabulous fa fa fab fabuloso Vutot. Strawberry trifle and corbo la creme, and that is my terrible tr attempt at reading things with foreign accents, but that was complete fail. So we go into this little area with uh kind of autumn trees and we see a little gingerbread house. We can hear someone munching and slurping, and here's a thing. Which is the got memo for the battle, and it says that king will be rolling around, so make sure he doesn't get past. Knock him down knock him around to make him burn calories and then push him into the fork at the top. Two citizens with high HP and can easily break rocks to help you out. And that means miners and people with high HP. Basically. That's why you brought things up like I mean things up. People like, you know, the soldiers. And now we get ambushed by Onis. Now it's very important that you take your time with these guys because they are hard. And they take away a bunch of your health and they charge at you and they are merciless. I mean they are completely merciless, so just try to ambush one by one, then if you watch them puff up, you just call your people back, like so, and just run around, try and target, try and target one at a time, like that, and if you're lucky, they'll kill them, and you can move on to the next ones. Just keep moving. Do not stop moving. If you do, you'll die. Try to kill this one. Do it! Oh, okay, he's dead. Great. Oh, I think someone lost a health thing. Just keep moving. Keep moving. Do not stop moving. Sh okay. Whoops. Rude word. Call him back. As soon as you... Oh, someone lost a health shard thing. Now, it's important to keep Corbo with full health, too. So we're doing that, and that's great. Now that's... He's dead. Only one left, and we can kill him, I think. Yes, we can! That was pretty easy, I think. But yes, it was. Now let's break that stupid gingerbread house down. That's right. Uh, it's gonna take a while. Now, if we had some merchants with us, we could've... Uh, dug up a hidden treasure, which was around here, or was it here? I don't know, but there's a hidden treasure right here, so uh, that's great if you have merchants, but we don't have the merchants right now, so too bad. We need to save up for them, because they're expensive, and oh my god, some hands popping out of the thing. It's creepy. And the big reveal is... Uh, just a little bit left, and it is... It's... It's... Monty Python. No, just kidding. Oh, it's a cutscene! Oh, God. 